you ever get to the campsite and realize there was something you forgot to pack? Well, stick around. We're gonna show you how to make sure you remember everything you need. Well, hey everyone, welcome to the channel. I'm Jennifer. I'm Daniel. And this is Cherish the Journey. And if you're new here, thank you for joining us. Today, we're gonna to be talking about how to make sure you remember everything you need for when you go tent camping. I can't tell you how many times we've gotten to the campsite we're happy, we're excited, we're there, we're setting up and unpacking everything, and I'm looking for something and I can't find it, only to realize I left it at home. Sometimes when I'm, when I'm packing, I get ahead of myself. Sometimes my thoughts get ahead of the actions that I'm actually taking to pack things. So I found a way for me to pack everything so that way I don't forget anything. Yep, so yeah. we came up with a solution of get one of those big black totes with the yellow top or whatever bin you want to use. Um, we just prefer those because they're rugged and sturdy and last. But what you wanna do is you wanna put everything essential, blankets, uh, toiletries, if you're gonna have towels or beach towels or anything to that nature, extra pairs of socks, things like that. So things that you aren't gonna be using every day at home. So like Daniel said, toiletries, that toilet paper that you wanna take with you for camping, you can put that in the bin. Extra paper towels, you can put a roll of paper towels in the bin because you probably have more than one roll of paper towels at your house at one time. So you can put a, um, a roll of those in the bin. You can also put some extra paper plates in the bin if you want to so you don't forget. Buy a set of plastic silverware ahead of time and just throw that in the bin. That way it's already ready to go. So just all these things that you would normally use camping that you don't need to use every day around your house, you can put in this bin. You can even label this bin camping stuff or however you want to label it. And you can set it aside. And then that way, when you're ready to go camping, you know that you have mostly everything that you need. You throw that bin into your truck or your car or whatever, and you go. And that way you know that when you get to the campsite, you have everything you need because most of that stuff you are able to pack ahead of time and just have that ready on the side for whenever you're gonna go. What I do is I make a list of all the things I need, all the things we're gonna need for a camping weekend. And then I take, I pick and choose all the things, like I said, that we don't use every day around our house. And I highlight those or however you wanna do it, however, whatever works for you, I put all that stuff in a bin and then I just set that bin aside, like I said, so that way we make sure we don't forget anything. And like Daniel said, we add um, towels in there. We go camping a lot in the summer. We go near lakes or rivers or whatever. And so I think I will actually put an extra bathing suit in there and our water shoes, that way we don't forget those. Um, and just all the things that we need, things that are gonna be essential to us having an amazing camping weekend. Um, so I don't know if you want to add anything to that, Daniel. What else do we bring with us? What's, what else is good to have with you and make sure you put in that tote so that way you are ensured that you're going to have everything you need. So an extra thing that you want to make sure to have, either you can put it in your car or truck, whatever. You want to make sure that you have this and it is a vest a safety vest you can pick these up at home depot or lowe's or any um hardware store and it's just perfect for in case you have a blowout or anything you have to pull over to the side of the road on your way when you're camping this is a great highly visible vest so if you're walking down a trail somebody's gonna see you you won't get run over this is a great tool to have and it also has reflectors on the side as well. So at nighttime, you'll be visible as well. Another thing guys, and I highly suggest this is an emergency kit. Keep it in your car, put an extra one in, put it in a vehicle, every vehicle that you have. It's just good uh, practice to have because it'll have band-aids, gauze, um, put some flashlights in there and tweezers, tweezers what like else that. and so um we even put some fire starters in there yeah. in case you need to start a fire mm -hmm. um you'll put a lighter in there and then also we got this guy here it's just a cool outdoor first aid kit um you i bought we got this at rei store a camping store mm -hmm. um 
I think a lot of places have them like Walmart has a good first aid kit that you can throw in your car. Yep. Um, you know, it just comes with band-aids and uh, ointments and wipes and instructions. It comes with a lot. Um, just tweezers, everything that you need. Um, another thing I bring, I don't pack it ahead of time because I never forget it, but for any of you out there that use essential oils, I always bring my essential oils because I have actually burned myself on our Camp Chef one time when I was cooking, and so I used the lavender oil that I had in there, and it actually did bring down the burning a little bit, or um, I used the peppermint oil because some there are certain bugs that don't like that peppermint smell, and so it just keeps those away from me, but they're are so many things that you can use essential oils for when you're out camping. So for those of you that have essential oils, I highly recommend bringing them with you because they'll come in handy, I promise you. I hope this video brought value to you. I hope that you learned something. If you did, make sure that you give us a great big thumbs up. Share it with a friend or family that goes camping or just share the heck out of it. It would really help us out and if you did like this video as well and you want to see more of it make sure that you hit that subscribe button down below because you don't want to miss a video and and if you hit that bell notification it'll alert you every time we release a new video make sure you comment below whether you like the video or if there was something that we missed and you thought of something that we didn't think of please let us know in the comments we would love to make sure that we are remembering everything when we're doing videos and if there's something you guys wanted to know about that we didn't even touch on, please let us know in the comments so we can answer back to you. Always remember to cherish your journey and cherish the moments that you're in, and we will see you guys on the next video. Peace.